beginning so it can kind of get in there and tack up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, it's the uh, in Salt Lake City. Uh, it's actually not our full production factory, but it is the, it's where we make one model fully in-house and we also do all of our production uh, prototyping. We've got press right now. We actually have a, a ski in the press, which is a custom ski for one of our new riders, David Wise. Um, we've got a, basically making a full um, half-pipe shape with race base and race uh, specs on it, make it nice and stiff and poppy for him. Um, well, basically what we do here is we are able to make a full physical prototype of the ski. We're able to go out and ski on it the next day and decide what we like, what we don't like. We can change it. It's, everything's kind of fluid. It's nice and easy to, to make you know, bigger little changes. And you know, if we make something and we hate it, we're not stuck with it. We're not, you know, there's no six-week turnaround to what a lot of these people that are working with production facilities are. Um, and so with the... With the pro or with the having the press here, we're able to make um, real-time prototypes and real real-time conditions. You know, and if it's going to be pound next week, then we can make skis this week and ski on them in pound next week, and then go out and say, "This is the best. This is the best pound ski I've ever skied on." So send it off. Let's make this thing. Let's do it. And that's uh, that's kind of the bottom line is that we can we can do things much quicker and much much more in line with uh, what people want and what our athletes want and what we want. Go. Anything else? Thanks. No problem. That's it. Andrew from BackcountrySkiingCanada.com. Thanks again to Cody and to the Forefront team.